most people underutilize paid traffic. Pay per click enables you to generate instant traffic and make some measurements. When you know that a keyword converts and generates you money, then it's time to consider a natural search engine campaign. There are very few well optimized sites on the net. That's good for you, but only if your site is one of them. Take www.smartteachers.co.uk. They make the classic mistake of putting the name of the domain in the title. Another error is putting the name of your company in the title. This is such a waste. The number of people searching to solve a problem exceeds the number of people searching for your name many times over. The title is one of the most important assets on your website. In this case, it should contain words like teacher recruitment or teacher jobs, and these words should be as far to the left as possible. The second mistake on this site is the domain name smartteachers.co.uk is not redirected to www.smartteachers.co.uk. It is possible for Google to decide that these are two different domains with exactly the same duplicate content, which is bad. The redirect must be a 301 permanent redirect, not a meta refresh. The next problem is the lack of a meta description tag. If the description tag contains the search term, then Google will take that description and display it on its results page. If you don't have the meta description tag, then Google will take the text that it wants. Now you don't have control. The description is your sales pitch, the opportunity to get your result clicked. Using a plugin for Firefox, we can check the keyword density on a page. Why is this important? There are two ways to get listed on Google on-site optimization and links with the keyword phrase in the anchor text. Since we are focusing on on-site optimization, if the keyword phrase doesn't appear on the page, then you will never get listed for it. Two obvious keywords for this site would be teacher jobs and teacher recruitment. Both produce the same outcome. These keywords don't appear anywhere on the page. The next area to look at is URLs. Never use underscores. Google treats smart underscore teacher as one word that must be typed in exactly including the underscore to be found. However, Google treats smart dash teacher as two words and can be found using either a space or the dash, i.e. smart space teacher. Finally, the URL names can be used to contribute to your search rankings. Search results benefit greatly if instead of a URL like question mark ID equals 1513, the URL read English-jobs forward slash London query ID equals 1513. I have a suggestion. Using this video as a template, look at your website. Check the titles, check the URLs, check the content. Each page should be optimized for a single keyword phrase. Go through each page and ask yourself what keyword phrase is this page optimized for? I teach clients to rank in Google and how to create online video, a bit like this one. The workshops are normally half a day or a full day. I also do one-to-one -one consultancy. Watch out for future videos on SEO and video.